Okay, hey everybody, it is your girl Special Edition Barbie. Um, y'all, I'm coming to y'all from my bedroom in my bed. I have just had a absolutely long day of shopping. I am located in Kansas City, Kansas, and right now we are having the no tax weekend. It's but it's like if you know where that is. But anyway, they're having a the no tax weekend, so you know what time it is. It is super. Super uber duper shopping time, ladies. Like, when I say that, I mean it is shopping time. Anywho, so let's get down to what I bought. This video consists of a shopping haul from Forever 21, H&M, Rainbow, Express. Um, Where else did I shop? Uh, just all these different places. City Trends. Um, Just different little stores that I like to go to. Some cheaper than most and some really expensive. So it's in between. Of, as in all, I spent $130 um, with all the items that I got. I have got so many things that is crazy. Everything was on sale. Some stuff wasn't, but most of my majority of my stuff was on sale, or it was just great pricing in general. And then I have a few gifts from my best friend. Um, I'm, I'll be going to college this fall, so she got me a few items. We're best friends. We've been best friends for years. So she got me a few items from Pink. Yeah. She loves giving me expensive stuff. So, just, mm. But anyway, <laughs> when it's like gift time. So, okay, so let's get started. This is my H&M bag. Comes in this bag right here. I got, I spent $35 in H&M, remind you, $35. Okay, so I got this skirt here. You guys see it? The skirt is like the um, what stripe blue and white stripes with the little belt. Really nice. This video is gonna be super long. Anyway, this was only seven dollars. Okay, I know what I'm gonna do with this. I know I'm pretty neat to be shopping for fall, but what I'm gonna do with that, I am going to just throw some little leggings on with it, and yeah, just throw some leggings on with it, some boots, a jacket, and a scarf. It'll be just fine. I promise. Not leggings, I think tights. So, yeah. Okay, so continue on with the video. Try and get through these all fast, or I have so much. So, here's a little shirt from H&M. It says, I believe the shirt says, Chupa Chupa, Chupa Chups, or Chups, Chupa Chups. I'm not sure. Anyway, it's from... What is this from H and M? It was five dollars. It's on top of five dollars, and yeah, it's just a little crop top. I'm not sure. I know it's a candy though. That's the item I got from there. Then, as I was about to like just walking around, about to go to the catchers, I saw these little tank top shirts. These are like little crop top tank tops. It's really thin, but you can easily turn this into winter. All you need to do is put put this on with like a cardigan or something. Or some type of like sweater like thing, put a scarf on, it's fine. You can definitely turn it into winter. So they were on sale for four ninety nine. So yeah, um I think the original price of this was like only ten dollars, so it wasn't too much difference. But I got one with this type of print on it. Um, I got another one. Where is that? It's, I got the same thing the same little thin same little thin top or whatever. But I got it in um this burnt orangey red. It's showing up orange on the camera, but it's more like that orangey red tone that you see everywhere pretty much in the spring. I mean the summer. I mean the summer. Anyways, let's get back to the stuff. So I also paid $5 for that one. This was on sale for 6 Well, the regular price for this was $6.99 at H&M. This is just a burgundy crop top. I think you need a lot of burgundy stuff in the fall that just goes good with all outfits. I don't know if I'm holding them up too far, but yeah. But this is a burgundy crop top for $6.99. Then I got the same one in a white. Can't go wrong with white tops. I love white tops. I get them dirty so fast, but I just love a fresh white shirt. So also $6.99. So the total there was $35. Yeah, it was thirty six, thirty five ninety six with the no tax and just ringing up everything. So yeah, that's what I got from H and M. Let's move on to my Forever Twenty One bag. Okay, so the Forever Twenty One bag 
Um, right there when I went to Forever Twenty One, I love their jeans. They are so cheap and they do last. I think Forever Twenty One jeans last about a year because they last from like one school year to the beginning of the next school year. So it's still around like a year. Anyway, so I got me some side um some of their jeans. They're like some regular blue jeans, and I got them for twelve ninety. The denim pants, short denim. That's what I got. Twelve ninety. Can't go wrong there. So I got that. Um, I also got something that I saw that they had online, but they had in store at my Forever Twenty One, which was this little V neck sweater, kind of like the varsity look. They also have, if you go to Forever 21 and they have this at yours, they also have a sweater dress that is burgundy with the same v-neck cut. I tried that on in everything in the store. It fit, it looks so pretty on that burgundy. is such a beautiful burgundy, especially with my, like, tannish skin tone. It looks really nice. The thing is, though, it is tight-fitting and it's short. And when you walk, it will, excuse me, it will rise. It really will rise. So if you are trying to get that, I would get... Oh, God, excuse me. I would get something one size bigger than your normal size. So if you are large, get an extra large because it is tight and it's kind of like, yeah, when you walk, it starts rising. It'll turn into a shirt after five steps. But anyway, so I got this one in the shirt, and it is so pretty on y'all, like really pretty. That, that black is just a beautiful black. Then I got some more jeans, another set of jeans, darker jeans. For $12.90. And I got two headbands. This is my first time. I went to Forever 21 twice today. So, yeah. Sorry about that, guys. Just my camera. Okay, so, yeah. So, this is the headband I got. This with the little bow. Like this, I'm always wearing headbands. So, yeah. And this one was $3.90. That little peachy plumish color. Then I got a central gray one. I mean, just a regular gray one. You always need a gray headband, working out or whatever. And this one was two ninety. So yeah, that's what I got the first time. Second time I went to Forever Twenty One, I bought some socks. Oh, another thing they were doing was the student discount. So if you had like some ID or something and said you were a student, they gave you extra fifteen percent off. So yeah, I got everything with the extra fifteen percent off and everything. So I'm paying forty dollars at Forever Twenty One. Then I got these socks. They were four dollars. But then I got them for like three bucks. These are the over the boot socks. So they're really nice. Um, you just, what I'm going to do when I'm putting them over some jeans, scrunch them up real good. Like just a little bit above the boot and give you that nice little scrunchy look. It's really nice. I'm pretty sure you guys seen it around. So that look, but that's what I'm going for. Then I went to Express. Express had like not a lot of stuff for me and my size and Express is kind of expensive. So, like, the clearance rack, I always go to the clearance rack first. It had, like, some decent stuff, but the sizing wasn't as good as I expected. So, and all in all, I really just didn't get anything. I'd rather not. So, I ended up buying this scarf. A nice little scarf. You can just throw this on with, like, a cardigan for the fall and some brown boots and a brown leather jacket. It looks really nice. Um, This scarf was on sale for $10. And then they had like additional 25 or 30% off, something in that area. And it ended up, yeah, it was 40% off. And it ended up making the scarf $6. So, yeah. Okay. I'm not sure if you guys heard of this store before. But these are just like these little boutiques. It's just like regular stores they where they're not really like in, I don't know, like a plaza or a mall. This store is called Rainbow. Um, their bags look like this. Rainbow. Um, from Rainbow, I just bought two pairs of leggings. You can't go wrong with buying leggings. These I bought like a navy blue pair, and they were ringing up three dollars. Yes, ladies, three dollars for each pair of leggings. They are like the feel of maybe Forever Twenty One leggings, or even softer. Those nice cotton ones that you don't even want to wear underwear with. That's the type of leggings they wear. So I got two pairs of leggings from that store. And I got like this blue one. This is pretty much the color they're showing up on thing. And they rung up. They were ringing up three dollars, even though they said five. So I got two pairs because that's all they had in my size, or I would have bought more. 
So bad. Okay, so let's get to my pink. Now, what I bought from first of all, let's talk about this little bitty bag they gave me for my one shirt that I bought. <sighs> Y'all, they gave me this little bitty bag. I mean, really, this did not make me feel like a happy shopper. Like, even if I got one item, I want to feel like I bought, like, several items. So, giving me this little Pikachu pink little bag was very disturbing. So, yes. This is the bag. Did not like that. But anyway, so I got something off. Maybe because I bought something off clearance. Maybe that's why. Shoot. I don't know. This shirt was $15.99. I got this one. Um, This is all I got in there with the little green at the top. It kind of looked like something for fall. Um, The little black and the green. So, yeah, that's what I got. Then my best friend, she bought me this tank top. We did the two for 32. So, she got me this one. And she got one. Yeah, there we go. The little pink tank top with the little doggy in the corner. So, yeah, really nice. Thought that was nice of her. And she also got me some sweatpants. They were on sale for like $26. Got me a pair of sweatpants. The pink sweatpants with like that on it. Like I'm going to college, so you don't need to have like dressy, dressy outfits every day. And then it has this on the other leg. So a lot of sweats and all that is very called for. So that's what I got at pink. Then there's one more store that I went to. And... Honestly, ladies, I really don't care about pricing and all this stuff. I just look out for deals. So this store was called City Trend. Um, their bag is just a simple bag like this. And it says City Trend. I got a few items for City Trend. So I bought my own. I bought some sweats at City Trend. Um, this one, these were, I don't know where to take. Oh, these were $6.99. $7 little sweats. They actually remind me of some Love Pink sweats. They're very, like, almost a knockoff of them. Am I, like, crazy about that? I really don't even care because sweats are sweats, and I'm just looking for something to keep me warm and affordable. So they look like this at the top. And then, like, this pants leg is clear, and it has, like, this at the bottom. And then the other pants leg, oops, turn it around, looks like this. This kind of reminds me of something in pink. I don't even know if they have anything like that, really. But it just says, Love's Hurt 92. So that looks like something pink would have. And then this little box. They're so comfortable on, y'all. I tried them on. They're really comfortable. So I got those for $6.99. Then I bought another pair of jogging pants from there. And they were on sale. They were regular price. These are regular price. $6.99 sweats. Okay. Here you go. These are by Wild Punch, extra large, Wild Punch. And then on this side of the pants, they got this, like, thing, this little embroidered words right here. I think it says, what did they say? I don't, I don't even know what the pants say. I just thought they were cute. Oh, long something, y'all. Long what? Oh. 80 what this is crazy this is 85 love nation that's what they say on the side 85 love nation okay so yeah so that and then on this side it has the 85 love put on that side so i'm thinking they're trying to get more sweats that looks like love sweats at a cheaper price I'm not even sure, but they're just very comfortable. Like I said, I'm going to college, so you just need, like, sweats. And, like, you don't have to dress up all the time for school because it's just really laid back and everyone's pretty much in the same boat. We're all broke. So, yeah. <laughs> okay, so then I have two more things I got from there. And I got this little tank top shirt, probably for working out and stuff or just one of those laid back days. This tank top shirt says, High Maintenance Advisory. Flawless content looks just like that, and it looks really good on. It really makes me look a lot slimmer. That's what it's like. And then the last thing I got from this store. Oh, how much was that? That's a good question. Okay, it was on. It was four fifty, but they had like twenty five percent off. 
It was like between three twenty five or something like that. I think for that shirt. Then this shirt has got the little emojis on it, like that. It's a crop top with emojis on it. I usually do not buy emoji anything, but these ones are a little bit like not rinky dink. You know, the other ones are like really big and like I don't know, like three D. Like I don't know. These ones are a little bit calmer <laughs> and not in your face. Um, I don't even see the price tag on this one, but it was the same price. It was that four fifty. Oh, there it is. Yeah, it was four fifty. So. Yeah, four fifty, and then it was like three twenty five with the extra discount. So that's what happened there. When I went to that store, I spent twenty dollars. So I'm not sure exactly overall, but I know for a fact that I spent maybe to a hundred to hundred and thirty dollars. I know I spent thirty five dollars at H and M. I spent forty dollars at Forever Twenty One, and I spent twenty dollars there. Spent nine dollars here. So yeah, I think I probably came at one hundred and thirty dollars just correct me if i'm wrong i'm not sure i didn't even add it up <laughs> i'm just telling y'all <laughs> i just remember each price when i got up to the check stand checkout stand so anyway so yeah this is what my day been consisting of i've been shopping all day and this is what i got i think for that amount of money i did not spend i know for a fact i did not spend more than 150 dollars this all these items is under i mean everything i got all of, i probably got what was that? I know y'all didn't count, but I'm pretty sure it was between 25 items over here, and I got them all less than $200, so I think I did really good with the no tax season and catching a lot of the deals this weekend. This is just day one. This is Friday, and I'm probably going to go out one more time tomorrow to catch a few more, maybe on boots and shoes tomorrow. Not so much um, anything else, and just trying to, you know, just pair up some stuff, get some little outfits going. But for the most part, I had an awesome day shopping, and there was great deals at all these stores. So if you do not have any of these stores in your area, it's nothing to Google them and see if they have them, like Rainbow.com, City Trend, Express, H&M, um, Victoria's Secret, all these different stores. If you don't have them all in your area, just make sure to Google them, and they should pop up and show you the closest one or even give you a website. So yeah, thank you so much. Special Edition Barbie is out. I'm so sorry, y'all. I did not get glammed up for this video, but my eyebrows is on fleek. They are on fleek. But, yeah, besides that, my hair is kind of rough. I did not put any cute clothes on for this video. I just want to give it to you guys raw, fresh, <laughs> and just really just exactly what happened. I didn't want to wait a few days. So, anyway, this is it. My shopping haul. Bye, guys. See you in the next video. Special Den Barbie is out.